Hello everyone, Fungor here from Barformation, and today we are going to be adding um, layers to my Lego city. Uh, so basically I came up with um, the idea of having the sea lower than the, well, roads and seaport and construction area. Um, and my idea for that was cardboard. Now, I've laid out the base plates that need covering with cardboard. Um, so that, and then that one, but I didn't have enough plates. So basically, that whole L needed to be covered, or basically need to, to cover two bricks worth of, um, well, height. Uh, so, of course, the sea level would be right there and then the harbor would be right there I, I know it could be higher and maybe maybe in the future we will go higher but for now this will be quite perfect and then i thought um why not actually do a cutout for the construction area the construction sites and have that one layer lower one brick lower as the actual roads and buildings and the seaport so my dad came to me and he said, I've got this stuff. Now, I don't know what it's called. I think it's some sort of drywall, but I'm not sure. It's like a foam layer. He uses it for the floor, but it's very sturdy. Um, and he made a little layout of it um, to lay on these plates. Yeah. So we are going to lay out this construction stuff and lay the base plates on so we know how to layer it and you might be asking wait but if you want the construction site to be one brick lower how are you going to do that well i'm going to use the cardboard spoilers i'm not going to use the cardboard so as you can see the base plates have been laid out the layout has been figured out so what we're going to do now is rip apart the entire city i know it's going to be annoying as hell if i may but it's gonna be worth it in the end because we're gonna have an awesome layered Lego city. And then we're also gonna be redoing the docks um, in this video, actually. I hate doing this, but my lovely construction site is gonna come apart. Even more spoilers, in the next city video, you're gonna see the construction site be even better than it was before because let's be honest, this, this was rubbish. Yeah, that is all the vehicles um, removed. Of course, I'm gonna keep the boats because why would I take apart the boats? That would like make no sense. Um, so I'm just gonna scoop over here with me hand and grab all these figs don't really think i've got something on hand that i can dump them in doesn't appear so uh so i'll be right back once i've destroyed this entire part of the city all right most of the table we want cleared is clear and now i will be putting on the well sort of platform areas so <clears throat> we can get this in one case it's very light this is probably doable right go right we go like that those hit so we got that one in oh there's a piece of lights in there right this should be it I know it's not too much um, height difference, but it's something. And I hope this really works. Let me zoom out there on the super zoom on this phone. Um, and now we are gonna be building back the city. Let's first see how this construction site will work. Does it connect? No, it doesn't. Well, you can always put brick there. Yeah, I think, oh, that's not it at all. That is not it at all. Yeah, this is definitely unsung. Well, I guess it's not too, too bad. Um, yeah, I think I might actually keep the construction set down here. Um, I think I like it like this. Um, we'll see. We'll see what I do. First, let's, uh, let's, uh, you know. Dump all the sets back on. Alrighty, we have laid out the, well, the layout. And it looks so sad with no crane here. There's no height. Um, yeah, I am most definitely keeping the construction side to bricks down. It will be sort of 
parts intensive to cover all that up, but I think we can do that with random pieces. Now you might be wondering, why would you do that with random pieces? Because it's a construction set and it's not, we can just say it's all painted and unpainted and rest and sp spare stuff. And we can just raise up that road, have it be like it's being constructed, like actual prop for mills roads and I'm sort of gonna have to work on this road as well, but yeah. Um, I'm now going to be placing bricks all along this side for the dock. So I will be right back. So right here I am finishing up with the... Sorry, the camera did a bit weird. Um, with the um, attachment of the main harbor to the dock. The dock sticks out, as you can see, six bricks. And I know this is blue, but you're just going to have to do with that. Um, and I added um, a layer of red to sort of spruce it up on because it's parts it's part intensive i don't i don't have that many gray or red parts i really i really like like to build my sets so you know um that's why i don't have many parts laying around and i'm just now finishing up this detail so i just wanted to document me finishing this part of the dock now all we need is some plates alongside here and then we can finally start adding back in the details and i'm not gonna have another extending docker that's just too part intensive i will keep this one um because it's fun and then we can put in the boats back in and also romania flag yeah i didn't notice that before i'm like oh my god that's 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 the romania flag that's funny because i love romania oh i just realized i made a mistake so uh, it's actually supposed to stick out so oh i can disassemble that all again lovely well it's not that many pieces but still it's annoying um i will be back as this is finished so i am back and i have decided that i want rid of that mills sort of mills plate so i took it apart and i have made it back into an old road and what i'm gonna say is that it's either a one-way street or just an old part of town that still needs updating so i might even put a construction site here are you surprised i don't think you are now of course there are still casually boats on the street um, you know they do that over here um but i've also been working on this yeah ain't that cool it's just a wall um, that goes around here. And I've also laid out tile because I, again, as I said in the previous update, want to order some tiles and make that all light bluish gray tile. But until then, it's gonna look like this. And I'm gonna have minifigs on top of it because I want minifigs there. And yeah, I think I'm just gonna end the video here. I will do a city update once everything is finished. Uh, like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!